Now I'm feeling 100%. I made sure not to rush it this time because I did get re-injured after the French Open. So I've been working a lot on the things I can improve and how to prevent things like this from happening. And I've been training really hard. I've been working a lot on my um, physique because I think that's one part of my game that I really wanted to improve. So I think this these past couple of weeks really helped me accomplish that. I'm slowly getting back into competition mode. Um, I've had many experiences where I was injured, had to take time off and then go back and start playing again. So I have no problem with that because I've been preparing well. I've been playing a lot of matches before this. But after the French Open, I took some time off obviously because of my injury. So I got to explore more of Paris, which was really nice. It's one of my favorite cities. And then I got the chance to explore more of Toronto as well, and I got to celebrate my 19th birthday here. And I went to a couple games as well, um, and them winning was incredible, really. It was a historic moment. It means everything to me. This is my home. I've been practicing on these courts ever since I was nine years old, and I've played many tournaments here before, and I got the chance to play on this court in the main job back in 2017, so I know a little bit of what to expect. Obviously, these are different circumstances, but um, I'm really looking forward to it.